Luke 2, 1 to 7, the birth of Jesus. In those days, Caesar Augustus issued a decree that a census should be taken of the entire Roman world. This was the first census that took place while Quirinius was governor of Syria. And everyone went to their own town to register. So Joseph also went up from the town of Nazareth in Galilee to Judea, to Bethlehem, the town of David, because he belongs to the house and line of David. He went there to register with Mary, who was pledged to be married to him and was expecting a child. While they were there, the time came for the baby to be born, and she gave birth to her firstborn, a son. She wrapped him in cloths and placed him in a manger because there was no guest room available for them. Amen. Luca ta eve. Kiki bantova said Adrenalia. Luca ta eve. Kiki bantova said Adrenalia. Yes, Gigi. Aye, over Vama, Lankaka Mao Maba. Sada Dacho Kaisaro Augusto Bobana. Wafla Hikama Kata Anglon. Monglog Banta Sia Vama. Asima Kirenu La Moma Fia Dumla Syria. Aya Mao Kata Jamo Haiba. Wanglo of Unco. Ama Siama. Yida Yemuto for Duma. Aya Yosef Hajola Galilea. To Nazareth, Dulama, Haye Judea, De Dawid Du, Sioyona Ber, Bethlehem Lama, Alabana, Echo Dawid Pama, Kla Apo Malama, Bawanglo Aya Club Maria, Ama Simu Bautone, Signor Funola, Funko, Aye Asiwola, Fimala, Ava Vama Ber, Afanka Kala Daba Wati, Aya Wajimu Tuvi, Sinya van Gogba vi, aye wo hacha avoda ngu, aye wo chwa emlon la dudu numa, a la bana, wuma kwota fe, la mbajwo jafe o, amen. Praise the Lord. Let us pray. Our Father, our Lord, our Master, our Leader, we want to thank you for this morning that you have brought us together as a family to celebrate Christmas. We want to thank you for your son, Jesus Christ, whom you have given to us, in whom we live. Father, even as we meet this day, for the celebration, we pray be with us. Give your word to us again. You have always done so. Bless us in Jesus' name. Amen. Today is Christmas. Egbe inye Christmas. And I wish you the blessings of Christmas even before I start delivering the message. Hallelujah. The Christmas story is a very broad one. Yesu Christo pe jiji wuti nya e nya gan kle nya didi wunye. It's very broad. And when we look at the entire story, we can draw several, several themes from it. If you read one portion, you can draw a theme. You read another portion, you can draw another theme. For instance, if you read about the way the angel came to Mary and Mary said, how can this be? You can draw a theme from there. The theme based on faith that whatever God plans for you will come true. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Obey Maudola Gabriel, Eva Maria Bo, 
Ya be Maria a fofu ajivi. Ya ba o leke nu ya va me. Enya ma de de la wa te wa de nya ti cho me. Ko se penya. Be na ho ma u penya. Be wa va me now. Praise the Lord. Ka ndia this morning I want us to draw a theme from the reading. This is the reading for the day, the main reading for the day. I will refer to other passages, but this is the main reading for the day. That's Luke chapter 2, verses 1 to 7. And I want us to look at this thing. The Lord is your promoter. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. God had planned several hundreds of years before the birth of Jesus Christ. That is, before the birth of Jesus Christ, God had planned it already. And God spoke through the prophets that the time will come when he will give his son, Jesus Christ, to die for us. But how that was going to happen, no one knew. But the Mount of Bledi, Pau Pau, Palafau, Beyacho Yevi Christo Anna, Yaka Leika O Bono Nobe, Leika Wava, America Menya, Yaka Mika Yahoa Dola, Avame. Whatever God plans, whatever God says, says about you will come true. But this morning, I want to add that sometimes God uses people or God allows people to do certain things for what he has said about you to come true. You know, yeah, mau edie mo na mau be wa wo na no Benu ike mau blo le ngula ni vame. Ido inu ike mie blo alo inu ike mie doa edo unu begle unyo. Gaka wo mau ike lulu ike triakwa ele mo dege numa ajo benu ike wo do de ngula ni vame. Eya ta mi chonya ti ya be mau eya enye ameike duwa uden go. So God allows people sometimes to do certain things. Those things may appear very, very negative. What have I said? The things may appear what? Positive. No, very negative. But God in his own way he turns those things around to fulfill the purpose of your life. Say my life. Hallelujah. God had planned that Jesus would come and that Jesus was going to be born in Bethlehem. Maudwebe Yesu Ava E Maudwebe de Obo Yesu Jige Le Bethlehem Gake ye yi yi ke Maria ho don bene ho fo fui. Men no Bethlehem. At the time that Mary was pregnant, she was not in Bethlehem. She was in Nazareth. In Galilee. It's like saying the promise is that the child will be born in Keta or Volta region. But now you are in Pram Pram in the greater Accra region. Hallelujah. Dogole Abeobe Obo Vie Jibele Keta 
le voter region kaka america for fuola amia me le voter region o me le kata e le pram pram le greater akra region jesus was going to be born in bethlehem if you read micah chapter 5 verse 2 it says but you bethlehem ephrata though you are small among the clans of judah out of you will come for me the one who will be ruler over israel hallelujah so god had said this several several years that bethlehem ephrata ephrata means fruitful bethlehem small town village you are fruitful because in you the messiah will be born hallelujah mau fa nya gbele di hoho emi ha fa gbanle ta ton ku ku ebe ebe di e wo bethlehem ephrata ephrata go me nya be ku cheche o ba me o ya wa ji messiah lale ta mau do be wa ji messiah lale bethlehem kaka me ike fofu ola eno nazareth leke wa wo have you ever jibevie le bethlehem how will the child be born in bethlehem and that is why we have this thing that your god has the plans for you he is the one who promotes you he is the one who paves the way before you he is the one who leads the way someone somewhere out of his uh, power uh, something that he thinks he has may want to do something but in doing that god's will will only come true in your life hallelujah yet ami le gbogbo be amara te wan afire do ma hia mi ele un sen san ge awona ne do ma hia chi tre de wo ga ke le e ma wo wo me la yehowa ma u pe ta me dodo ajeji le wa gbele so when mary was pregnant when the time was due for her to deliver the roman emperor caesar augustus he made a decree that everybody should go back to where he comes from to his hometown hallelujah that was a decree Augustus Caesar would have thought that oh yes I'm a powerful king I am an emperor now I have decree this is my decree everybody should get up go to your to your to your place of birth to your hometown so that you can be you can be numbered so that there could be census hallelujah and in that in doing that Mary and Joseph had to move from nazareth to bethlehem hallelujah bebe amerika fofu bo vie ji gbe di e no nazareth ga ke fi mi ho be no ji vie le ya yen bethlehem le ke maria a wo ha fi a ba do re bethlehem a ji vie vodi na o me ji vie le bethlehem o la ke ma ma o pe nya me me va mo ela be ma u pe nya gbo be di bethlehem ya wa ji vie le ya me ike fofu la le nazareth abale ike me gbo ame ike fofu e le pram pram ya o be wa ji vie le keta bo me nya gbe he e hule e wa do bu abe okay mi do bu mi re keta ta ne ma u me we o ji vie le keta we ke mi ma wo ya me fa mo ga ke ma wi ke subo mi le la un san ka tan to o yen e wo e gbe ple wo e choi e le wa si me the god we worship is a great god your present and your future they are all in his hands ta be wa va ji vie le bethlehem ya mi sebe e me ke maria fofu he vie ji we do de 
ya e duplo laga amekenye roma jidula ike ponu to mame yo kete israel tonwa ya o degbe kaiser augusto ba mesiame ne jo wa yi ye un to de dume be wa klamo to finila ya maria to le nazareth yi de betlehem be ma u penya ni va me hallelujah this morning i want to demonstrate to you again again and again again and again that it is the lord who holds your portion indi a medi ma ga do peji now a ga do peji now ana wa gede ma o be yehowa wo mawi e ya ile wo jijenu da si praise the lord we can mau bene jo le wa gbe ni ya ko ya jo whatever god wants you to be that which he wants to take he wants that which he desires that it should take place in your life that is what to take place and this is why cleaving unto god unto his word is very important for the christian because it is the lord who holds your portion mebe ma wi ya ile wo jijenu da si e ya ta be na no ma wo wo jine kudam na so pli ele be be de and so as we enter into 2019 your one desire should be that you will be close to god your one desire should be that you will love the lord that you worship the lord and you will do it not just as a duty but you really be ready to serve the lord ta temi lege gege de fe bubu me what ta me do do wo diti elebe ni nye beri ya zo ple yehoa elabe ya e me nya me bubu de ke o hallelujah you know sometimes when god speaks and this happen even in the prophecies when god speaks about your future he speaks in the present maule mi ke wa vanye chogbolo egble abe enu ode va me hoho e ni kwele yesu christo pe va va me ha the people who walk in darkness is it will see or what they have seen a great light the people who are walking in darkness they have seen a great light god was speaking in the present yet the people were still walking in darkness but god says they have seen a great light hallelujah so certain things that you are even expecting you should think of it in the present that it has happened hallelujah not that it will happen it has happened maybe you don't in a mauke le nupo le nwe egbele abe nwo ejo Zigede. Oba du ko si le viviti me zom la po keke li gande. Menye a po keke li yoro. Kake yi ma yi me hole yi ak bloy. Am yo ga le viviti me. Ta nu yo ke ha o le mo po na yi. Ele ben a po nu le mo. A ben nuo de va me koko ene. Hallelujah. Ela ba o titre de ma upe nyaji o titre de ma upe usaji ta me ponu o ga ke e ko ese be de e va me hallelujah ma enye wo usan the lord is your strength to lead you
to give you enablement. You see, if God is on your path, on your side, you are victorious. Hallelujah. I, I, want one, I want one young man to come here. Come. One, just one. I want one Sunday school boy to come. Give me one Sunday school boy. One, one of the boys. Come. No, not the, not the small one. Not the small, small one. The quite, quite older. Yes. Now, if, if we say that these two people, they are going to contest, they are going to fight. Now, you are not going to fight. And we look at them. The, what will be your feeling? Who will be the victor? Who will beat who? This is number one, this is number two. Who will beat who from, 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 from the way you are looking at them? Number one will beat number two. Oh, yes. Number two will beat number three. Number four will beat number five. Oh, yes. Number six will beat number Maybe the first one has even undergone training. Maybe if he removes his shirt, you look, you see his muscles. But you see, if God is on the side of this man, <laughs> Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Maybe this one has not, uh, has not received any much training. But God is on his side. Hallelujah. And so if God is on your side, you are victorious. Please can you take your seat. You are not going to fight. Hallelujah. So sometimes, you look at it outwardly. And you think, no, this is how the thing is going. With God, it is different. Hallelujah. You know you are going to be now, the demonstration that I have done now, when you look into scriptures, you find several examples of this. The journey of the Israelites, the way God led them, God's people, how he gave them victory. Remember, when the Israelites left Egypt and they were going to the promised land, look, they did not carry weapons, but they defeated people. Oh, yes. Because they were journeying. Israel 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 the Lord is your promoter. And this is one lesson I want us to draw this Christmas. The decree of Caesar Augustus. The Roman Emperor. That everybody go back to where you come from. And in doing that, the purpose of God was fulfilled. Maybe Christmas ya enyahi medibe makona wenye e kaizaru agustu pese dede e ba mesia mene gubo ye unto de e le e ma gbogbolo mela ma ufe nya ma ufe dodo ma ufe tame dodo you can leave na eh, Maria. Bele keke me dukoa. Tame rodo ma evame. Hallelujah. Yehoa fe tame rodo ne vame le wakbe me. May the will, the purpose of God be fulfilled in your life. 
irrespective of what may be happening, irrespective of what somebody may have done or may have planned to do, the purpose of the Lord should come true in your life. Hallelujah. See, before I conclude, I would like to remind you that in following Christ, you experience a number of things that he experienced. Le Christo yo me je je me nu kede yo ke me ho to yi wo ha a to me a to de o me yi ke a di nu yi ke me Christo to Now you think this one is applicable to your life If I draw another lesson another thing from the Christmas story it will still apply to your life If I draw a third one it will apply to your life the word of god says the sun will not smite you by day nor the moon by night. You will look up to the Lord. You will trust the Lord. You will depend on the Lord and receive from him. As you enter into the year 2019, it is my prayer that you receive from the Lord. That the Lord who is your strength will unfold great things before you. That he will lead you. You will walk through the valleys of shadows of death and you will fear no evil because the Lord your God is with you. The God we worship is a God whom we can trust. Maui ke yo me mi lea. Enye maui ke umi ate wan don do. Me dog beda. Be a le wo gege de fa ke vekle wi a se ke ma. A zo. A zo ingo. Re ma duo len ke ke mo. Gile ti han le za mo. Ne zo bali do blu kon chidi chidi me hama. Von jok be vwen de kao. E la bena e ya ma li kle o. To wa te da to be wa vada. Ye ho wa fa men ve ve ma te da le bo o. Ye ho wa wo nubla ni kola e ble. This morning. Maybe the Lord has spoken to you. The things that happen in, with, around Jesus are the very things that will happen in and around you. just feel like praying for one or two people who may want to be prayed for if you are here I think you want to be prayed for I want to pray for you the Lord is your portion the Lord is your promoter the Ni yoke jong, le Christo fak beme. Le ifak beme. Kude ya maun, nu mao ke koya jong. Ne le fi ye di bem, to berak le ya. To berak lo. O wa inye wo mousen, re ma do len ke ke me. Alo yi le ti han le zaman. Because he lives, I can face tomorrow. Because he by might nor by power but by the spirit of the living God who gave us his son Jesus Christ 
and has demonstrated to us that he has power and that he is our promoter. Just close your eyes. Spirit of the living God, I pray your presence now in accordance with your word that you are the promoter. Yea, even things that people plan against us, you turn those things around for our good. My Father and my God, for all your children who are seated before you, everything planned against them, Lord, in your spirit, in your power, in your enablement, Lord, may you move. In Jesus' name, Afeto me do bera, le wo mau bag be fa wu se, le wo wu tete me, nu se anu ike wa do de novi ya unti, wo nyam me be tofu nu do do, me do bera ekbe, le Jesus Christo pan koma, be wo ike tronu o, Yehovah tronu o, le Jesus Christo pan koma, Holy Spirit descend, mau fa bobo, didi de novi ya unti. Did it all fuck Beji? Did it all fuck Beji? A fetto me do bera. A messia me ketcho de wula. Naga ko jije jeo. Le Jesus Christo pan kome. A messia me ketcho de novi ya wula. Etcho de wo mau bag be fek bobo uti. Mau fek bobo. De zole wo wusa me. Lord, we want you to demonstrate this so that your children can see, so that they can believe in your word more. In the name of Jesus Christ, Father, I pray that you touch every one of them. Father, give them encouragement, give them strength, lift them up. No weapon of the enemy fashioned against them will prosper. Holy Spirit, may your presence be here. In Jesus' name, as never before. In Jesus' name. Afecto, we bene to tera, to be opada, you are men veve matera le mia go, be ye ho amia penu blani polai gle, me to be rabe na konu blani na wodolai ao, le yesu christo pan kome. Afeto be wava dida se aglobe wo Yehoi. Father, I pray. Even as they walk back to their seats, give them peace. Peace that they can testify about. Give them peace. The peace that passes every understanding. Give it to them. Give it to them. Give them peace. Give them peace. Them peace. In the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. We are your children. Give them peace. In Jesus' name. May the peace of God which passes every understanding rest and abide with you now and forevermore. Amen.